I'm Leah Griffith, DIY designer, educator, photographer, stylist, and CEO. And I believe that everyone can be creative. When I started this company four years ago, I didn't really consider myself a teacher at that point, but after maybe three, four months and seeing the response and having the conversations with people who are engaging with my projects, made me realize I'm a teacher. This is what I'm doing, I'm teaching. But it's not just I'm teaching a craft, I'm teaching people how to remember their creative. When I'm sitting down and designing a project or a new flower, I like to imagine that I'm crafting with a 10 year old or that I'm crafting with grandma who's 80 and you know maybe she has a little bit of arthritis but she really loves getting in there. And then everyone in between and I want the projects to be easy enough that anyone can make them and it needs to be beautiful, you know, elevated, something that you'll want to keep for a very long time. So accessibility is one of my words. I it's really important for how I want this business to continue because what we do is for everybody. As we grow up for some reason or another, whether it be environment or, or it's just not an opportunity for us, we, we start to lose our creativity. We're watching TV, we're on our computers all day and we're missing that tactile creative process. I was blessed to be given the opportunity to grow up in a creative family where this was our lifestyle, this is what we knew. And I know not everybody has that. That doesn't make them less creative, it just means they haven't had the opportunity. This ability to see things inside out and to be able to design things that I can pass on to people is what I'm here for. I'm here to take my skill and pass it out to those who haven't had that opportunity so they can have a taste of it. Make something, teach it, they make it, they give it, you know, so it just keeps going bigger and bigger. I got an email from a lady who had been a reader of my site for a while and she told me about how she lived in this town in Africa and she had to move to a more rural town and that she had been invited by the local school to come in and teach the kids how to make some crafts and so she chose to make paper flowers with these kids. And she told me that she had been so nervous and scared she had never really worked with other people like this or taught classes and that she just channeled Leah. And she sent me pictures of these kids and all their bright shining faces holding their flowers and told me how she had felt so touched that she had really changed these kids' lives even for just a moment. And tears just rolled down my eyes. And, and it was like, this is why I do what I do. It's more than just making something and ooh, look at that. It's, it's something that empowers us. Being creative is empowering to the soul. It nurtures the soul. Creativity creates community. It helps us connect with each other. And it's something that everyone, everyone can be blessed with. We all need more of it. We need more of it. And I don't know of anyone who doesn't need more creativity. It's like, you can't have enough love. You know, the more you have, the, the better life is, right? Creativity goes right in there with it. What feeds my soul is seeing the joy in people when they create and when they, when they feel that esteem kind of bloom inside of themselves because they watch themselves make something. Isn't that better than watching TV and consuming, consuming? Let's make and give. Let's create. Let's bring joy. I want this to be a place that people know they can come. They can come and be inspired. They can come and feel encouraged. They can come to, uh, you know, just find a smile. See a beautiful project that just makes them smile or even laugh. And I want to be a place. I want to be that place for them. 